We'll guide you through how to extend the C drive in Windows 11. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. This is really useful to be able to do. The amount of space that you can go and extend it by will depend upon your system. So let's go and get right into this. First of all, you need to go and open up disk management. You can go and look in your file explorer as well. As you can see, here's how mine currently looks. So to go and do this, right click on the start button at the bottom and you can go and select disk management. Now, what you need to do is come to the lower part here and go and find the disk your C drives on. As you can see, here it is. So the amount you can go and increase it by will depend upon the other drives on your disk and how much space they're taking up. We can go and see I've only got one other drive on the disk, which is 1.5 gigabytes roughly. So we can go and extend the C drive by that. So we'll need to go and delete it. So make sure you back up anything on that drive. We can see it's called new volume E. So I can find that in my file explorer. I haven't got anything I want to keep on it. So I can then right click on it. Make sure you right click the correct drive you're wanting to delete. Then click delete volume. Remember all data will be deleted and you can press yes. Now the space is unallocated. Then you can go and right click on the C drive and you can click on extend volume. Press next and you can then go and choose the space you want to use. In this case, I'm using this here, 1.5 gigabytes or 1500 megabytes. Then we can press next and press finish. And like so, you've now gone and extended the C drive. As I said, the more space taken up by other drives is gonna be the more space you can then go and extend the C drive by. 